Um, police brutality is a real thing. And the police take it to a whole new meaning because of that badge on their chest. They feel that they have the right to do what they want and say what they want and they feel that they can't be touched. And my main goal is to let the cops know that they can be touched. This edition of the Ridley Report is brought to you by... All right, I'm standing here with... Who am I standing here with? My name is Jonathan Wayne. Hi, Jonathan. Well, uh, I was just walking past, and of course, as you may imagine, something stopped me. Yeah, the Black Lives Matter Tahoe. So uh, what made you decide to, to, uh, to, to just bury your, your, your vehicle in, uh, in uh, political slogans? Um, more or less, the racial, slow, uh, the, like, the racial stuff going on. Um, pretty much everything that's been going on with all the police brutality, killing cops, um, cops killing people, the riots, the protests, and I just don't think it's fair to judge people on their skin. I mean, if I cut you and you cut me, we're still bleeding the same color. So it doesn't really matter who we are or what color we are. It's more or less to put the awareness out there for all lives matter, not just black lives, but all lives. And the reason why people are saying black lives matter is because it isn't white people out there getting killed by cops. It's mostly black people dying. And exactly, most lives don't matter until black lives matter. And it's, it's, it's a shame. This country should not be at this ceremony right now. And it's just not right. To, to what extent do you think uh, the, the kind of thing that you're doing is going to result in real change? A year from now, things will really be different. Um, what we're doing is we're uh, actually uh, we have two cars like this. And we're going to be driving from here in New Hampshire to San Diego, California, and every little town in between, and doing miniature protests and rallies all across the country. Um, we're hoping to have a little bit more peace between, raci between races and hopefully have cops doing what they're supposed to do instead of just being villain. Is, uh, is there an, an organization that you represent or a URL that you're associating with yourself? I'm actually doing this freelance, um, just me and my brother over here. And we're just doing this out of the kind and goodwill of our hearts, honestly. Uh, anything else you'd like to add? Um, Black Lives Matter and take care of the people in front of you. Fuck the racism. All right. I appreciate your time. If it's all right, I'm going to give you shots to your yeah, machine. Go ahead, no Was there anything like technical that like uh, that you had to do, or I'm like decisions um, you had to make, or I mean, we just souped this thing up to make it really loud, really fast, and we're actually getting the tires changed right now because we like to throw in smoke at every red light. Um, so you'll see us today. We're going to be out here burning tires, <laughs> making some noise, and, and we're just trying to make some love happen. We're sick of all the hate. All right. Thanks much. All right, brother. You too. Have a great day. You too. You know, one thing I should have asked you and forgot is, um, what is your suggested solution? My solution? That's actually a good question. My suggested solution is that we take the police and disarm them. There's no need for public leos to have police. If we look at all the other countries in this world, um, we're about the only country that still use armed armed police and scare tactics. If you look at England, their cars are bright yellow, their cops don't carry guns, and there's not as much violence. Um, police brutality is a real thing. And the police take it to a whole new meaning because of that badge on their chest. They feel that they have the right to do what they want and say what they want, and they feel that they can't be touched. And my main goal is to let the cops know that they can be touched. You've seen the dramatic liberty arrests in Keene, New Hampshire. Now see 111 reasons why you should move there and reinforce these gutsy activists. Keene's advantages are compelling. For details, visit freekeen.com